Want to automate Teams group chat messages with smart conditions? This video is for you. Hello everyone. Today in this video, I will show you how to dynamically post messages in Microsoft Teams group chat using the Power Automate flow. For instance, I have these two group chats, Demo Teams group chat 1 and Demo Teams group chat 2. If I post something in group chat 1, which starts with certain text, then that message also will be posted in group chat 2 automatically, otherwise that message will be posted only in group chat 1. I will show this how I have developed using the Power Automate flow. Let me post a message in the demo group chat 1, something like analysis for Q1 sales report. Here is the sales performance breakdown for Q1. This post starts with the text analysis for, so this message should be posted automatically in the demo group chat 2 as well. Let's post this message in the demo group chat 1 and see whether it gets posted automatically in the demo group chat 2 as well. Yes, you can see that the same message has been posted in the demo group chat 2 as well automatically. We can see the same message here group chat 2. Analysis for Q1 sales report. Here is the sales performance breakdown for Q1. Now, I will send some different messages that will not start with the text analysis for. Then this message should only be posted in group chat 1. It won't be posted in group chat 2. For example, I am posting this message. Team, here is the sales performance breakdown for Q1. Now, this post won't go to the group chat 2, as this doesn't start with the text analysis for. So, this is how I have implemented this logic in my flow. Now I will show you how I have developed this flow. This is the Power Automate flow. I have created for this automated message posting where I have used the trigger as when a new message is added to a chat or channel. For the message type, I have selected the group chat and see other options like channel. I have selected group chat here. Here I have selected my demo group chat one as that is my trigger point. Once a message is posted in this demo group chat one, this flow will be triggered. Then add it and apply to each control. Now, I am looping through the body value of the trigger output. Then, inside this apply to each control loop, I have added an action, get message details. Where for the message, I am passing the dynamic message ID from the trigger output. Then, message type selected as group chat. And for the group chat, I have passed my demo teams group chat one. You can see how I have passed the dynamic message ID. Message type as group chat and group chat as demo teams group chat one. Then I have added a condition control. Where I am checking the get message details body plain text content. If it starts with the text analysis for. If the value of plain text content starts with the text analysis for. Then, in the yes part, I have added this action, post message in a chat or channel. Where I am passing post as flow bot, post in as group chat. You can see the other options for post as like user, flow bot, and power virtual agents. And then I have selected the group chat as demo teams group chat too. Other options for post in like channel and chat with Flowbot. I select a group chat here. So if my message in group chat one starts with an analysis, I'm sending that message into this group demo teams group chat two. For the message parameter, I'm passing this body content of get message details action. This is how this flow is working. If any messages are posted in group chat one, which starts with the text analysis for, then that message is also posted in group chat two. Otherwise, it will only post in group chat one. I hope you found this demo insightful and learned something new today. If it helped you, please subscribe. Your support truly means a lot. More exciting content is coming. Stay tuned for in-depth videos on Microsoft Copilot, Gen AI, Power Platform, Power Apps, Power Automate, SharePoint Online, AI, and more.
Let's explore the future of technology together. Your support helps this channel grow.